When Dwayne The Rock Johnson announced last week that he and his family had tested positive for the novel coronavirus, COVID-19, he admitted that one of the most difficult parts of the whole ordeal was the fact that his entire family got sick. I wish it was only me who tested positive, but it wasn't. It was my entire family. So this one was a real kick in the gut, he said. My number one priority is to always protect my family and protect my children, my loved ones. Luckily, the actor, 48, and his wife, Lauren Hashian, and their daughters, Jasmine, 4, and Chiana, 2, have now recovered. A source says Johnson, who is also dad to Simone, 19, with ex-wife, Danny Garcia, always puts his family first. Dwayne The Rock Johnson, his wife and daughters, 4 and 2, test positive for COVID-19. Dwayne Johnson and his family have tested positive for the novel coronavirus, COVID-19. The star revealed on Instagram Wednesday, he absolutely loves his girls. They live out of the spotlight so these girls can have a normal childhood, says the source. His family is his biggest priority. The source adds that Johnson is a very private guy that always focuses on his work and family. He is a huge family man, says the source. Johnson and Hashian celebrated their one-year wedding anniversary in August. The pair first met in 2006 and began dating in 2007. However, when WrestleMania 40 takes over Philadelphia in early April, there's a good chance we will see one of the biggest matches of the modern era and one of the most exciting matchups of the 21st century. Though a one-on-one -on -one bout has yet to be confirmed between the two, it appears as if WWE Universal Champion Roman Reigns will take on Dwayne The Rock Johnson in a match that could be up there with the latter's WrestleMania 18 match against Hollywood Hulk Hogan, at least in terms of mainstream appeal. The two cousins, have been teasing a showdown ever since The Rock returned to WWE at the start of 2024, but their history goes back years. This is something that has been a long time coming. Let's break down a history shared by these two future WWE Hall of Famers and their potential fight for the title of Head of the Table. Roman Reigns and The Rock are both members of the Anuai family wrestling dynasty. When it comes to family dynasties in the sport of professional wrestling, few are as prolific and successful as the Anuai family. Taking a look at the family tree, you'll find all-time great Pacific Islander wrestlers like Rikishi, Yokozuna, the Wild Samoans, and countless others with successes in the ring dating back to the early days of WWE. In today's WWE, Roman Reigns is, without a doubt, the biggest name in the family and he has used the dynasty's history and dynamics the past few years as part of the bloodline stable. Though the Rock isn't an actual relative of Roman Reigns, he's considered part of the Anuai family because his maternal grandfather, Peter Mabia, and Emichuani Anuai were blood brothers, and that connection has sustained over the past few decades. Not quite blood, but closer than friends, these two WWE superstars have been a part of each other's lives for years. The Rock tried and failed to get Roman Reigns over with fans at the 2015 Royal Rumble. The Rock and Roman Reigns WWE interactions go back to the early days of The Shield, when the dominant stable performed the signature triple powerbomb on the People's Champion. However, the family connection between the future tribal chief and wrestler-turned-actor didn't become a part of the story until the disastrous 2015 Royal Rumble, where The Rock tried to put Reigns over in front of a Philadelphia crowd that was just not having it. Hello lovely viewers, welcome to my channel. I am Shown. Hope your day is so well. If you liked the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel.